prison. The police department. Why am I here? How's Lily doing? Great. Everything's going fine. Just wish my wife would be home more to take care of her. She barely took maternity leave, huh? One of Crimson's finest, I suppose. She's a great cop in her own right. But we can manage without her for a little longer. You should hope she doesn't hear you say that, or you'll be out in your ass, Joseph. This looks like it's way before I got here. Everyone's so much younger. But Sebastian's profile didn't say he was married. Let alone a child. to talk. Going off with your conspiracy theories? You're getting out of control. You don't pull that in front of the captain. I'm on to something, Joseph. I don't need you hiding shit from me, too. I'm not, Sebastian. I'm trying to help. I want to help. But you need to think about this carefully. Your daughter. It was a loss everyone on the force felt. But your wife is... Myra left, Joseph. She left. When we needed each other the most, Myra left me. What would make her do that? I have to know. I don't care what it costs. His daughter, then his wife? One right after the other? No wonder he always seems so closed off.
Julie Kidman? She barely has any experience. We don't even know anything about her. Send her out canvassing witnesses, then. Let her see the streets. No. She's... she's coming with us. I'm going to train her. She's my responsibility. Look, I know you say it's personal, and I don't like to talk about it. But we can't have your misplaced guilt leading to rookies slowing us down. Sebastian. He and Joseph weren't supposed to be involved. It shouldn't have happened like this. You've been on assignment for a week. How has it been? Observe and report, just like you ordered. It's surreal to be on the other side after all I've been through. Any signs of anything? Nothing yet. I'm not about to be caught snooping around the classified room while I'm still on probation, so I can't get what they have on us. Just earn their trust. That's all you can do now. It'll take a while, but in the end, they will let you in. I didn't know all these police officers were characters, though. Guess the tough, hard-boiled detective stereotype is still going strong. Our reports on Oda are that he doesn't let things slide. So be extra careful around him. Will do. Though I can't imagine us getting along well. And... Detective Castellanos. Anything you have to share on him? Seems drunk half the time. But at least he's considerate. Is he really the one people are concerned about? He seems almost harmless. He is... known to get emotional. Just make sure to give him his space. Respect him. As your superior. This is Crimson? This can't be real. Hope I can get there before he does. He's not coming back.
experimentation has demanded more and more subjects. And sad to say, their suffering as much as, if not more than, his previous patients. Fortunately, Beacon and the city offer no shortage of expendable subjects. I should feel guiltier than I do, but my Hippocratic oath was abandoned long ago. The scientific and medical potential of the work is too great to be denied. Mobius has also offered me a respectable amount of compensation. Promoting me to director at Beacon is not something to be taken lightly. First, however, they want me to have a reputation, publishing studies in various journals, repurposing some of Rubin's research towards patient evaluation seems viable. I doubt he will even notice. Stop now. <sighs> well, here's where you'll be living. The view's pretty spectacular, huh? <sighs> Holy shit. This is... Different than I'm used to. If you saw where I grew up. The past is over. You're with us now. Here are the keys. It's yours. You'll have to take care of your own food, clothing, and incidentals. But your bank account has more than enough to take care of that. So, that's it? What am I supposed to do? Whatever you desire. But your assignment at the Crimson City Police Department is precedent to everything. You are a police officer, and you must live as such, and act as such. I don't normally say this, but thank you. You shouldn't be thanking us. These aren't gifts we provide. You have a very specific assignment at KCPD, and all of this is in exchange for that. Okay, you're right. Sorry. Don't apologize. Just show us you can do your job.
said I shouldn't be. But I am thankful. I don't know what would have happened to me if you hadn't brought me in. The mark. Looks like it might be my only way out. This is your last chance to prove yourself to us, kid. Don't let us down. Bring the boy to us. Stop it! Get out of my head!
Did Ruvik send you? Well, I hope he gets the message. Kidman! Are you in there? Sebastian? Save it for later. There are probably more of them around. Sebastian? What is... Stay back. She's my responsibility. Sorry for putting you through this. I don't want to hurt you any more than I already have. You might try to stop me through you. A little hasty with that gun, kid. What is it you plan on doing? What I have to do. No! You do what we say. You will come back with that boy, or you will disappear. Think you can do anything to stop this? Stop, damn it! You don't understand! We don't need your excuses, kid. You run because you're weak. You're afraid of us. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Find out. Shit! What are you doing? Answer me.
Can you discern between evil and good? <laughs> Maybe I can burn through it. <laughs> 